and Connie Roeder. Uh, we figured since Tina does such a good job with, uh, we, we'd add more of the woman's touch to this, and, and she did a fantastic job bringing things together for us this year. So I want to introduce you to Connie Roeder and her two children, Kyle and Megan. They're coming up now. And at this time, I'd like to turn it over to a fellow board member, David Salkin, also Township Committeeman. Thank you, Charlie. Come on up on here. You're going to be part of my presentation. you got to help me out. So, you take one in. Hold that up. Step down a little bit. All right. Okay, you recognize that logo, I hope. So, Field Township residents, welcome to your park. I'm so happy that we're all here together to do this. In the, uh, I don't know, 20 years that I've been doing this, i got to tell you, I have never been more excited than this moment right now because... What we try and do with the Veterans Community Alliance is, is have a big party in the park for you and your neighbors so you can see each other and have some fun. We also want to honor our veterans. And so if you've been here before, you know what we do. We have our video display. We have a huge fireworks celebration. It's like our Freedom Fest. This is what we do. This is how Field Township rolls. But this year, we were able to pull something off that just every now and then something really cool happens. We have a special presentation tonight. Now, uh, Unfortunately, like these kids, they haven't seen their dad in a year because he's in Kuwait. And so because they haven't gotten to see their dad in a year, we thought we would have them be part of this presentation for something I think is really cool because we have another serviceman that we're going to be honoring tonight. And if he's available, um, I would like to introduce Lieutenant Colonel Roeder, their dad. They haven't seen him in a year, and they did not know he was going to be here, folks. How about standing up and saying, welcome home, Lieutenant Colonel Rhoda Field Township. So happy to have you back. He's our resident, and we're proud of him. I wish you could see his kids crying their eyes out. They're going to make me cry. This is the first time this family's been together for a year. These are the kind of sacrifices our service people make when they're deployed. And uh, I am really, really happy to welcome Lieutenant Colonel Roeder to the Freel Township stage. Lieutenant Colonel, welcome home. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I won't take uh, but two minutes. Uh, obviously, it's great to be back. Uh, if you only knew what happened over the past 24 hours with this group right here and what they've done to try and make this happen and keep this a secret from these guys, uh, I really, really do appreciate everything they've done uh, over the past, what, couple hours? Because uh, I was supposed to be home on the 15th, and everything sort of just uh, fell into place where I was able to come home today. And with Connie's help and, and this great group here, uh, I'm, I'm really just uh, in, your, in your debt forever. So I really do appreciate it. And uh, secondly, uh, while I have the mic, I, I do want to thank a lot of the families in Freehold. Uh, while I was gone, Connie and I were obviously in communication with technology, with Skype and everything. And all she could talk about was uh, all the families in Freehold that, that really assisted her with carpooling, managing the kids, uh, helping her get the kids to soccer, basketball, whatever it may be, and baseball. So I really want to just give a shout out to all the families in Freehold that helped Connie and the family. That really gave me a lot of peace of mind that nothing was being missed. Uh, and the fact that I couldn't be there was just really an inconvenience because Connie was, was running the show and, and everybody was really helping out and I, I really appreciate it. Thank you very much.